welcome back to my channel today I am coming with a little late with collection obsession for June um, I'm not prepared at all uh, but I just grabbed a f I, and this month I am gonna work with multiple collections because I am gonna start working on my um, on my Puerto Rican album and I have a lot of beach and sightseeing pictures I have not print them I'm gonna print as I go um, most likely uh, yeah I'm gonna print them as I go um, so I'm gonna show you the collections that I chose and I also gonna uh, I have some page kits that I already have with Cricut cuts that I ain't gonna be using these papers for so I have already I'm preparing I'm going to a two-day crop in June so I'm preparing and most likely this is the collections that I'm taking because I want to start work not this this is my dogs um, I'm working I'm um, doing some die cuts and all stuff but I'm gonna use the background these papers for background and stuff like that so I'm working on it that's why I'm a little behind so the first collection that I pull is I Love Summer by Echo Park uh, by Laurie Whitlock. It's very beachy, very tropical, perfect for my, um, it is summer. I went to Puerto Rico in October. But Puerto Rico is tropical, it's summer all year round. So I'm still gonna use the summer collections even though it was in October that I went. But that's how we're gonna use it. So then we have this cut apart and then that's the background. I got this in one of the warehouse sales. Very bright, very cute. With this, I, I didn't pull them, but I am gonna use all my summer templates from Kiwi Late. I mean Kiwi Lane. So, but I didn't pull them, but as I use some, um, you will see what I use. I have a stamp with this bus, so I'm gonna pull that stamp too, so I could use it. And I have a, I didn't see no fish, but I was on the beach. So I might use this and I have a close to my heart fish stamps. Um, I mean, I'm not prepared. There's going to be more that I'm going to add to this. I'm just going to show you the papers that I'm going to be using. And then, you know, my tools and stamps and all that. I'll, I'll bring it to the crop. And most likely that's how I did last month. I work on the crop and um, and then I have the stickers and then I have the coordinator um, card stuff that goes with this collection. So this is the first collection that I pull to use. And I, that's to work only on the beach pictures, which I have a whole, I, we went to two beach, so. Uh, and I, I also, you know, have um, other collection. The other collection that I'm going to use is a Kiwi Link collection from May 2021. And these are the templates that I'm going to use. And so it's this one. Um, this one has a uh, summer sunshine. Again, I didn't go in the summer, but I'm still going to use the summer titles because Puerto Rico, it is a tropical island and it's 90 degrees in October, so. So that's that. So these are the papers that I'm gonna be using. Kiwi Lane paper is very thick. It's as thick as, it's like the same as Carabella. So, beautiful. Oh, love this one. Tropical vacation, tropical phone. Good vibes only, playing the sun. Oh, I'm gonna be using that. 
Then we got this one. We got this one. And then we got the background papers. That sometimes I use them for background, sometimes I don't. And then we got the quarter parts, and then we got a title for that. But I'm creating Cricut titles and stuff like that. I'm creating a mini kit. So that was Summer Loving by Kiwi Lane. It was the May 2021 Kit Club. So I'm happy to use it because I'm determined to use it uh, my kits. Uh, even though I do Kiwi Friday, I'm still going to use this one. Well, I'm going to use a and two of them, I think. Um, the other one that I take is a page kit, but I could, I, could, I could come out maybe two to three layouts out of this. So these are the page kits by... Um, from Hobby Lobby when they were on clearance for $149. This one, I'm gonna think, but I think I should save this and order because Stamping Up has a stamp like that. It, it's out of stock right now. Um, but I think I have a close to my heart one that has, let me see this here. I have a close to my heart one that has, uh, it has the seahorse, it has the stars. I think it's in my other, um... Hold on. Yeah, I think it's in here, hold on. So, let's see, so I could add it to that page kit so when i use it this is another this is the one that i was saying for the other collection where is it yeah i have this one that i has to start oh i have it right here with close to my heart so these are the ones that i'm gonna be using adding to this kit So yeah, I'm not prepared guys. Like I said, I just pick randomly. Um, I'm late to preparing for this month, but it's okay. We still could do it. We still could do it. That's the good thing about having page kits like that in collections because you grab a few and this paper is very thin. So you need to back it up, but it's beautiful. Perfect for beach layouts, which I have a lot of things so but yeah Stampino has something like this but looking at looking at this I have the die for that yeah it's a smaller than the one from the from stamping up but the one from stamping up is out of stack and you're not supposed it's supposed to come back sometime in June but you know stamping up is to buy stuff is it's, it's, it's a it's crazy. Yo, I get them whenever everybody start buying everything, then I get the stuff. So I have these papers. Love this one for sand papers, and I had the sand thingy. Then this one with the foliage. They are one sided. We got this one, and then we got this beautiful wood grain. So that is this little page kit, but I could come out with two to three bit, two to three layouts out of here with this one. Then you got these stickers, then you got these other stickers, and then you got some flat alphas. Love these kits. I have I think when when that they went out, I bought all of them. I have not used them. I think maybe one. So this is another one that we're gonna be using. I gotta print pictures because like I said, I'm taking this kit to, I am gonna do video this week, this weekend, and then um, I will add more to this if I need to add more to take to the crop. Then we got this one. And I do have a 
stamp that I want to use. Let me see if I see it here. There you go, right here. Well, I got two. Where's the other one? So we got this one and this girls i have them in my cricket that i could cut them to, no in my silhouette that's where i have them and my silhouette this one is very bright so you got the thing you have some rhinestone you have some die cuts in this one and you got the letters and then you got the paper again it's very thin paper but i back it up in cardstock so it is fine love that paper and die cuts do you have her you got you got the in the die cut so i don't have to oh i have another uh, another stamp that i could do the bathing suit oh so i gotta look that up so that is that one we got this one we got the popsicles because it's summer we got the rainbows and we got this pineapple beautiful papers so i like to put the pretty papers on top so that is another kit that i'm gonna be using There's another collection that I'm gonna pull from close to my heart, but I will put that to go to the crab in case I need more. And then, then we got this one. It's gone to the beach, it's very beachy. And this one goes perfect with the June Kiwilin templates because it has an octopus template and I should receive them this week. So I am gonna be using those templates too. This one is very beachy, so. And I do have a lot of pictures of just the water because the beach is my happy place. And I, I go crazy throwing pictures, just at the water. That's so beautiful. And it goes perfect with the, so the June kit, no, I'm gonna work in the June kit with, um, it's okay, I have lots of pictures lots of pictures from that trip this one i'm going to use it for the plane right here for this layout i'm going to use this as a background i'm going to put it right here so i could know so that's for the plane on things so i'm just going to that there then we got this one and we got this one and then we got the sailing away i think i have some picture of some boats love all these papers happy that i'm going to use them finally because they've been sitting in my shelf for years so then we got all kind of the beach is calling i must go uh what it says dear beach i think about you all the time yes i do and i live in a place that there's no beach beach have rules relax and win enjoy sun sand waves going to the beach take me to the ocean let's go swimming i don't swim but and then we got this and then we got the things that they fall off but so yeah so um that is the collections that i randomly because like I said I want to start working on that album so I just pull beach collections summer collections so I could work um, start working on it and lastly I added these um, stamps that I'm, I could use as life is better at the beach, 
this one doesn't have the the die cuts i just have only the stamp but i could stamp it ahead of time and have my scan and cut cut it so it this one this one is very old then we got this splash she's chilling in the damn beach babe how beautiful is to do nothing and then rest after war ah oh, love it flip flops sun kiss then we got fish this one has the dyes this one's summer. This one doesn't have the dye. I could fussy cut it or have the scanning cut. This one has dyes. This one has, this is the collection that I'm gonna put the Cape Cod collection. Also, I am gonna be using that collection. So I will add that one later. So yeah, so this is what I pulled so far to play, to get me started playing in my for my album. Yeah, I like my albums to be eclectic. So not the whole album is one collection. I have a lot of papers. So I want to use a little bit of everything in my album. That's the way I like it, eclectic. So yeah. So those are the collections that I'm going to be playing with. And some stamp, I'm going to add more to that. Um, some it's some stamp. Maybe one day I just sit down and cut a whole bunch of things so I don't have to carry them. Uh, so that is what I have for June collection obsession. And let's see how much, how many layouts I make. We'll find out. So thank you for watching, and uh, make sure you follow everybody that is participating. The link are in the description below, so you can see what everybody creates. Um, that's what I wanted to share with you guys. Thank you for watching and until next time. Bye now.